Well, now that marijuana is legal in most states, consumers are exploring a range of new products, including edibles. But beginners beware. Eating cannabis is very different than puffing it. So we are rolling out a first timer's guide to edibles. So far, 19 states have legalized recreational marijuana use for adults. And while you can go old school and smoke the plant, many people are discovering edibles. Edibles are a concentrated cannabis extract that is suspended in a digestible food item. Faye Powell, Director of Education and Training for Item 9 Labs in Phoenix, Arizona, is here to help us understand these cannabis products, starting with how they work. Consuming edibles is gonna be very different than other methods of consumption. So when we inhale cannabis, the effects are almost immediate. But when we consume edibles, it takes a while for us to feel it. I know people, it takes 45 minutes. I know people, it takes three, four hours. Is there a reason why you should maybe try an edible as opposed to inhaling marijuana? Some people have health concerns about inhaling products. And it's tough to control how much you inhale. But when we consume edibles, we can say, I want to take this much. Which brings us to Faye's next tip, choosing the right test dosage for first time users. You have to purchase a couple of different things, use conservative test dosing, okay. and figure out which method works best for you. Okay, so like block out a weekend. <laughs> Not quite. Faye says the best approach is to test a small amount because marijuana has a biphasic effect. So biphasic effect means that when we consume a little bit, we get one effect. When we consume a little bit more, it's a little bit different. More, 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 different, different, different. She recommends starting small, like two to five milligrams in a gummy or pill form about three hours before bedtime. You feel, what you're trying to do is find your minimal effective dose, the smallest amount that you need to take to feel it. Mm. And so if we take it about three hours before we go to bed, if it's too much, we can just go to bed. The next night, if you didn't feel anything, add what you did the first night. So if you did two, do four, and then the next night do six until you find that minimal effective dose. We'll wrap up with buying advice. The choices can range from baked goods, gummies, and candy, which take a while to feel. Or there are options that work more quickly, like soda or a strip. Like a Listerine strip you put on your tongue and you're gonna feel that pretty quick. Licensed dispensaries have bud tenders who are well versed in their products. So when you come in and you say, I need this, I can say, oh, I helped this woman a week ago. She came in and told me how well it worked for her. From gummies to soda pop, testing the high waters with edibles. <laughs>